and Amelia Ross, winner of Money 2020's Payments Race, gave us some insight into the benefits of using cryptocurrency. We narrowed it down to three main reasons. The first one, community. Cryptocurrencies help keep wealth and money inside communities by allowing for these communities to essentially transfer uh, wealth and money um, for niche goods and services. So like-minded individuals can get together uh, and use cryptocurrencies with no oversight, no government intervention, no central authority to tell them how to use it uh, for particular goods and services. The second reason, it gives you complete control over your money. The greatest advantages to individuals and consumers is that it, it allows you to have, take control of your own money. So when we talk about wallets and storing Bitcoin in a wallet, you literally have complete control and possession of your money. Uh, you can send that to whomever you want, whenever you want, 24 seven, uh, it happens instantly. You're not exposed to the counterparty risk of having, you know, just a number in a bank account. When you have a bank account, you have a relationship with a bank. You know, you don't have full control over the money that's stored in that, that bank account. And last, it gives you the ability to have total privacy. When you do your transaction, your identity is uh, private. So you, as a, as a consumer, you don't feel like you've got to hand over all your data to the person that you're making the payment. It's just kept, it's just kept tri private. All of these developments are about to reach a tipping point. Local VIS are doing everything they can to keep money in their communities, starting with innovative cities like Austin. Keeping transactions local helps consumers understand the transparency of where their money is going when they're making a purchase. Austin is a, has a very vibrant local community and economy and we really take pride in the fact that we support local businesses. As our economy changes and we become more digital focused and we, more people start purchasing local products online, it's important to make sure that there's transparency in that transaction and that that same transaction, whether you bought it in store or online, still goes to support that local economy. In Austin, CityShare and Austin.City are using blockchain technology to create a localized, intimate connection between businesses and consumers. Um, primarily, it's fighting against the extraction economy, enabling the citizens of a city to get value from their city itself, whereas currently, um, many companies are selling things based upon the city, renting hotels based upon the city, all of that leveraging the assets of the city, but it never benefits the citizens. Um, as an example, often you can book a hotel online and a third of the money goes to the hotel booking agency, never makes it to your city, they don't hire one person in your city, and often the hotel itself is making less profit than that company did the booking. So the idea is to create a system to allow the citizens to benefit directly from their actions and actions happening with their city. So with our platform, you can book hotels in the city and the money stays in the city. You can book a table at a restaurant and the, that booking stays in the city. Um, and soon you can buy things from businesses on the system, from the city, the money stays in the city, from businesses in the city. So what's 